What have you been up to since VidCon? <laughs> been posting a lot of videos, I must admit. And I'm actually trying to... I went I went to the Caribbean and I've shot a vlog that's coming out on Wednesday. I'm going to be posting from like four times a week from July. Um, so just trying to ramp up what I do on, on social media and, and YouTube, um, covering more motivational topics and topics that people are afraid to talk about. They're a little bit controversial, if you will. Like, for instance, I had one where I just asked my friends, who just happened to be white, to ask me questions that they probably wouldn't want to ask, like, are afraid to ask, because I was like, just get it out, you know? And it was, it was good to have that open air. I want to have discussions like that on my channel as well, like, just get, you know, clear, clear everything up. Uh, I think right. that's, that's very healthy, especially in the world right now where everyone's like, ooh, you can't offend anyone, what if you say this? And, ooh. Right, right. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. Yeah, the world's getting really touchy. Everybody yeah, does. Nobody exactly. wants to be offended. Yeah, and I feel like unless you have discussions and conversations, then you're always going to have a barrier. And then is that barrier actually a good thing? If everyone's trying to be closer together by not offending each other, then why not just, you know, break it down of like, this, this is why I voted for this person. You know, like, oh, okay, cool. Right. I respect that you have your your views and your opinions and like i get that why can't you just do that and we'll come together that way instead yeah that's very good that i don't know if that's a popular opinion with a lot of um younger people in the world so it's refreshing to hear that from people we were able to hang out with overseas oh. yeah. well someone's uh there's always going to be people getting offended Offenses yeah, no must come. That verse comes to mind. It's going to happen somewhere somehow. Hey, do, you, do you think? Do you think? Do you think it's easy for people to get offended because we we hold such things in regard uh, that become almost things in our in our lives or our hearts that are our own little gods? What do you think? I, I, I get that as in like you have you've had a belief for so long that once someone even goes near it you're like oh, don't, 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 don't you dare and, and being, basically being offended is a way of guarding it um, I, I think it, it's it's tricky because then it's, it's essentially someone's belief is their core um, so if they truly are offended, it's like, okay, I didn't mean to step on your toes. I just didn't know where the line was for you and I as individuals. But right. then when people generalize stuff like that, of, oh, no, you're just okay not being offensive. But am I to that individual that I'm speaking to? I think that that's the gray area that no one's really talking about. Like, um, it, it goes so far. I think everyone's just a bit too... I'm scared. Everyone's scared. Well, you should be on the show more. We'll we will make sure that that happens. Good. I missed you guys. Well, These are we... interesting talks that I love to have. Yeah, that's that's why yeah, we're here. We'll definitely want to grab you back and have you on the show whenever you're un, you know unfortunately get trying to get your hard drive fixed. <laughs> yeah.